So first off the GoPro 3, so you've got the settings menu which you can set your frame rate and video resolution, so I've got the video at 720, field of view is wide, um, you know all the settings that you know and love, and you get the preview screen, which will go bigger, there you go, okay, so, so to compare the latency, I just point that there, and then you can see my hand coming down, Going up and down. Let's move that back a bit. There you go. Okay. Um, so it's a pretty decent amount of latency. I can start the camera, and that's now recording. So it's fine for working out whether things are going to be in shot, but obviously there's quite a delay on that. So we'll just compare the SJ4000 Wi-Fi and the uh, new Xiaomi Wii Yi and see how they compare. Okay, so this is the SJ4000 Wi-Fi and it pretty much works the same. You connect to the camera to Wi-Fi and then you've got your settings page where you can set your resolution so that I can set to 720-60. You can set your um, other settings. You don't have access to all the settings that are on the camera screen menu, but you get the the you know the most of them. Uh, one of them that you don't get on here is white balance. Also, I know white balance you do get. You don't get um, some of the others. Um, but anyway, it, it does the same thing. You get a preview screen that you can make full screen, and then you can point to what you're filming, and then we can see the latency on that. So again, it's quicker than the GoPro, but it's not quite real time. But for framing shots, it's perfect. And obviously, you can start and stop recording. So let's start recording. So that's now recording. And the latency is the same. So this this is the Xiaomi Yi, which again has Wi-Fi, again has an app. You can change your settings. You've got your quality. You've got your resolution. Uh, so pretty much the same, you can change all these things uh, and you have your live preview. This one is, doesn't do a full screen mode so you've only got that little shot but again it's enough to frame up what you're shooting. Uh, you can start and stop the camera from it, it shows you the battery, uh, is it 91%? So and again let's see the latency. So there you can compare. I hope that's useful.